Okay, hello everyone and welcome to the video. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can set up a super fund in Myob. So the first time you're going to probably come across this is when you're setting up an employee in the card file. So let's go have a look at the card file. Go to the card list. You go to the employee tab, which we're already on. We'll have a look at our employee, our staff member here, Mr. Charlie Watts. Now, when you're in the superannuation section underneath the payroll details tab, you need to set up the super fund here. You have an option of doing an easy add, which is fine just to get it in there for now, but it won't set up the USI number that is required to do the super stream. So what we're going to do, go back, put that in again. And we'll go click on this arrow here next to superannuation fund. Fund name, Australian super. Registered name. We're going to start typing in Australian super. Or the uh, USI number, which we get from our standard choice form here. This is our superannuation standard choice form that we give to the employee to fill out when they start up. And down here, you can see the unique super identifier, the USI, STA 0100 AU. So we can type in Australian super or we can type in the USI. The USI is more accurate because there'll be no mistakes with that. So we've got Australian super here, STA 0100 AU. Let's go have a look again at the super standard choice form to check that STA 0100 AU. So we're happy with that. Fund ABN comes up automatically. Employer membership number. This isn't used so much these days. So this is good enough to get it going. And here we are in the card file again. We can OK to save that and exit out. Pretty simple. The other way of doing it is if you don't want to go directly through the card file, you can go lists, superannuation funds, and then here you'll have a list of all your super funds, and you can click into the applicable one, add the settings in here, and then you can come over here and sign up for the super stream as well. So that's it, pretty much it, guys. You'll just need to, you won't need to input the USI to process uh, a payroll attached to a employee, but you will need it when it comes time to pay the super. So you might as well set it up from the beginning. Anyway, just a very quick video. Thanks a lot for watching. Hope I helped a little bit. Uh, if you want to book in a training session, we specialize in accounting software. You can go to the link in the description. Hit us up there. We can come out to your office. We can do online training. It can be a totally tailored session depending on what you need to get up to speed on. Other than that, thanks a lot for watching. We'll catch you later.